Okay, I'll be waiting. You just said that. Oh, Black Frost, hello. Wow. The prize right now is Black Frost. Okay. Motherfucker. Wow. Motherfucker. Wow. Motherfucker. Wow. Motherfucker. Wow. Motherfucker! Wait, what? You should just give up for now. Go home and relax for a bit. What? Can't I just... What? Can't I just keep going? What do you mean I should give up? I've just kept going at all the others until I got them. Fuck you! Hey. Parker-san. Hey, what should I... Nah, never mind. Let's train. Feel like I can become closer, bond will grow stronger, not alive. Wait, that's different. What are you going to do? Are you going to give Shinya the calling card? What? Why am I giving Shinya a calling card? I'm not changing Shinya. I'm changing his mum, aren't I? Oh, because he's going to give it to his mum, right? Huh? Huh? What do you mean? Wait, what? Another calling card? Hane Oda. Huh? My mom? The Phantom Thieves are targeting my mom? So she is bad after all. Is that what you think? Yeah. My mom used to be nice, but right now I think she's one of the bad guys. To be honest, I've thought that for a while now. Mom. Do you think they'll actually be able to change her heart? Believe in them. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. They are the Phantom Thieves, after all. So... Hey! Someone has to give this to my mum, right? Okay, I'll do it. Way to step up. I... It, it is kind of my fault that my mum got this way. She had to deal with a lot, raising me on her own. She had to get stronger, because I was so weak. But... But that's not an excuse to hurt the people around her. She fights with everyone, about everything, and ends up getting hurt. At this rate, my mum's gonna break. I want my mum to realise that she doesn't have to be strong for me anymore. But she won't listen to me when I tell her that. That's why I want to help the Phantom Thieves. I want to stop my mum. Let's save her. Parker-san? Yeah. Okay, I'll give her the calling card. She's my mom after all. I really want to help her. <laughs> the next time you see the Phantom Thieves, please tell them I said thank you. And thanks for talking to them about this, Parker-san. I'm going to teach you my best, strongest move. Oh yeah? I feel like my bond with Shinya is growing deeper. Shing! Electric Slug increases the damage inflicted by bullet hail. Ooh, that's nice. All right. That is very nice. Oh, I guess it's late. <laughs> hey, do me a favor. Don't tell anyone you saw me crying earlier, okay? Interacting with Shinya has made my heart grow. I feel like my kindness increased. Sure. <laughs> Later. Oh, and say hi to the Phantom Thieves for me. Later. Ah, you're back. P P P P. I gave the calling card to my mom. It was a little scary. Could you let the Phantom Thieves know? 
a mother's aggression. Alright. Do do do. What happened with the Phantom Thieves? There's not any follow up news coverage. Who knows? Maybe it was a broadcasting accident. I heard it might have been a prank, too. It's so strange how no one's seen Shido, especially since he was so confident at the beginning. I'm starting to not care about the elections. It's not like they're going to change anything anyway. That apathy is bad. Although if you were going to vote for Shido, that would have also been bad. But, vote. Thank you. The curry was delicious. Really, really frustrates me when people are like, oh, my vote doesn't count. It's not going to change anything. And it's like, yeah, sure. Individually, your one vote probably isn't going to be the one that swings it. But thinking that way is what causes like 50% of voters to not come. And like that is huge. <laughs> like that's insane. Like turnout here is usually like, I think like 70% or something. And that's decent, I think. Maybe, maybe that's too high. I can't remember. It's, 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 I think it's decently high here. But still, it's like, that's, even if it's 70%, that's 30% of the whole population. That's a lot of people not voting and not making their voice heard. I don't know. It just pisses me off when people don't vote. Today, we have a question about giving, oh wait, no, that's what we already did. Nice going. Um, coffee. Hey. Yep. Make sure you close do, 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 do. Right. If Y is available, good, good. Oya is also available. I feel like Oya is available more often than a Y, right? So we should probably do a Y. I feel like Oya is available like four times a week and otherwise like once or twice. Do we have a hanged man? We don't. To read this. the complete here. Hanged man. Is this what you always draw this persona? This is your power. Done already? What? No slacking off. Do. Right, why? What are you at, like rank 8 or something? Remember how I said I was going to give you a hard time? Well, I got a job for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. You'll be working in the shop today. Hurry on over, part-timer. Hey. Be careful with this gun. If anyone's interested in buying it, let me know right away. This thing's an antique. I'm not going to sell it to anyone less than a real gun expert. Oh, and about Suda. I heard he got excommunicated from the clan. Apparently his boss found out what happened. Serves him right, huh? Are you sure he's still alive? Yeah. I think so. Pretty big relief assuming it's true. I mean, that bastard pissed me off, but I never once wished he'd up and die on me. He did say he was going to kill you and your family, right? <laughs> this whole thing's been real crazy, though. I mean, Suda used to be the role model for upholding the code. I guess this is what he meant when he said times are changing. Hello? Oh, it's you. If you want to talk about Suda... Huh? Wait, what? The hell are you doing? Hey! You motherfucker! Hey, hold on! What's up? <sighs> Damn it! That bastard Masa's abduct abducted Kaoru! Who's Masa? From the Hashibi clan Hashiba clan. That guy you eavesdropped on at the diner, remember? 
God, that piece of shit. He knew about Suda's failure the whole time. I bet he was just waiting for a chance like this. We should hurry. Right, they're over at Seaside Park. I'll grab the keys shit. and lock up. Come on, let's go. Hey. Let Kaoru go. Take it easy, Mune-san. All I did was give him a friendly ride home from cram school. Ain't that right, Kaoru-kun? Dad, I'm sorry. He said he had some stuff to tell me about you. Then he... <clears throat> Kaoru. Man, ain't he just a great kid? Cut the bullshit, knob jockey. And what are you, Mune-san's little errand boy? Wait, I remember you. You're that weirdo from the diner. Hey. He said, let Kaoru go. Fuck off. I heard you the first time. So, what are you going to make me do? Great question. You know those modded guns you were going to give sooner? It'd be real nice to get my hands on them. There's a lieutenant spot open now, Suda's gone, but I still need to prove my worth before I can get it. And you're gonna help me do just that. <laughs> Sorry, Massa, but you got some real shitty timing. We just broke them all down. There's nothing left. You think that's gonna dissuade me? You know, I know everything about Kaoru-kun's situation. <laughs> what? My situation? Dad, what does he mean? Don't you remember what I told you in the car, Kaoru-kun? About your dad? About what he thinks of you? Right. I'm just a burden, aren't I? That's it, isn't it? Tell me, Dad. I can handle the truth. That ain't true. I'm trying to protect you, Kaoru. Hey, this family bullshit is real touching and all, but we're supposed to be negotiating here, remember? Why don't we start with a delivery date? The sooner the better in my book. Shit. God damn it. Oh, don't give me that shit. None of this would be happening if you didn't go and take the brat in. I knew it. Everything really is my fault. Kaoru. You need to trust your son. Peter. Hey, what are you two chatting about over there? Yo. Kaoru, listen. There's something I've been keeping from you for a while now, and you're probably not going to like it. Truth is, your real parents didn't die in a car crash. You were abandoned by your mother when you were still a baby. That's why I took you in. Believe it or not, I was actually part of the Yakuza back then. Huh? Oh man, I can't believe you really freaking told him, Mune-san. He's not lying, Kaoru-kun. From what I heard, your mom tried to sell you to us just so she could get her hands on some easy drug money. Sell me? Yup. And then when Mune-san here wasn't buying, she just dumped you and ran. And that's how you ended up with a Yakuza dad. Pretty crazy, huh? Ah, that's a relief. I've been trying to hold that in all day long. I couldn't wait to see the look on your face when you found out. Man, this is hilarious. Boo freaking who? How sad! <laughs> Enough. All of that might be true, but it's in the past now. I'm not a child anymore. And I'll, I'll never let a stupid secret like that get to me. Huh? So what if my mum dumped me? Or if my dad was part of the Yakuza? We might not be related by blood, but we're connected by the Gecko. So you... The Gecko? What? Is that a tattoo or something? So you know what? I don't care what you have to say about us. I'm me, and Munehisa Iwai is my dad. Heh. <sighs> Add a boy, Keoru. Listen, Masa, let's put an end to this right here, right now. We can start fresh. You seriously still don't get it, do you? Kaorukans. No, Massa. You're the one who doesn't get it. You... <laughs> oh, hello. You've really fucked it this time. Oh? Suda? Soda? I mean, sir? Don't give me that. I know you ratted me out to the boss. You never have been good at keeping your mouth shut. N 
No, it wasn't me. Uh-huh. And what do you think you're doing waving that knife around? Huh? Uh, I'm sorry. Your kid's got guts, Mune. Like father, like son, huh? Yo. Looks like it. So what now? We'll start by making this idiot repay his debts. I haven't thought much about what comes after. All I really know is, this is where we say goodbye, Mune. <clears throat> Take care, brother. Let's go. <sighs> Are you okay, Keoru? Yeah, I was a little afraid, but it's all better now. Yeah, honestly, I'm surprised you stayed calm through all that. Guess you're maturing quicker than I ever realized. Kaoru is really strong-willed. <sighs> yeah, sure is. I never would have been able to say all the shit he did. You know, I've been so busy making sure he doesn't end up like me that I forgot to see who he's actually becoming. Yeah, I can't believe I'm only just realizing this now. <laughs> appreciate it. And it's all thanks to you, kid. I appreciate it. For real. For real? It feels like my bond with Iwai is growing even deeper. Shing! Rank 9. One more for him. Was it two more for Shinya and two more for Oya? And that's it. Alright. So five total hangouts, but only a couple of days left. And we also need to go to Mementos, and it's just not going to happen. Hey, all that excitement made me super hungry. Why don't we go back to that diner? Heh. <laughs> you seriously eat on a whole nother level. You might even end up taller than me someday. Let's go. Come on, let's head over there. Let's go. <laughs> the three of us enjoyed a peaceful dinner together. Pee 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 pee. Yo, it's me. Sorry for that whole mess back there. I'm glad Kaoru's safe and all, but man, he ended up with a hell of an appetite after that. Sure was something. Connected by the gecko, huh? The kid must have grown into a man while I wasn't looking. Like father, like son. Gecko bonds go beyond blood. Ha! <laughs> what the hell are you even talking about? But I guess you might be right. A symbol of protection for the home and the family. Oh yeah, he's got the gecko on his neck. I guess Kaoru has that as well then? And somehow, the gecko actually did end up protecting my family. Sounds too perfect to be real. Ugh. After going out to eat with you guys, I can barely move. I'm too stuffed. But somehow, it's the best feeling in the whole damn world. Thanks, Peter. You did some great work. Ha! <laughs> you got me saying all this sappy shit. Downright embarrassing. I gotta go get some air. Cool down a little. Alright. Later. Gimme, gimme. Bye bye. Sixteenth. Two days remaining. Okay. Election day is only a couple of days away, and candidates are making their last appeals to voters. Among them, the United Future, led by Mr. Shido, has captured the hearts of many listeners. Mr. Shido still has yet to show his face in public, causing some people to raise concerns about his health. Nice. If Shido just spills the beans, everything will finally be over. Hmm? Didn't the Phantom Thieves die? I thought we were safe from them now. And then there's that calling card. Shido's son denied any of it was true, though. I wonder if Shido-san is okay. I'm worried, with the election so close. Oh, I don't know what to believe. It's all too much for an old-timer. Huh. Alright, what's going to happen? I have no clue either. Uh... So the only person left to do in the day would be Shinya, but Shinya is not available because we need to go do his Mementos request. So I guess that means we're going into Mementos right now? Which is also in the middle of an episode. So that's kind of awkward because <laughs> we don't normally do that, but uh, I think it's got to be done. Okay. 
It's the last request. I know it's frustrating, but all we can do now is wait. Uh, view requests. <laughs> you want to take on requests at a time like this? You're amazing, Peter. <laughs> Hearing cries of help in times of crisis, you truly are the leader of the Phantom Thieves of Justice. Well, everyone's here. This is a good opportunity to sort through the Memento's target info we have. We'll start yeah. with this one first. This intel is on a malicious producer in the showbiz world. Supposedly, he's been using the dreams of young women for his own personal profit. I bet countless women have succumbed to his plot. Huh. So there are other, so there are other guys out there just like Kamishida. This is unforgivable. We need to change his heart at once. I wonder, actually, now that we've beaten Shido, is another layer of mementos going to have opened up? I didn't think about that, but maybe we'll have more to do than just get these requests. Very well. Very well. I will go along with this. There are still more. Next is. This intel is about a womanizer. He believes all women should be conquered and enjoys turning girls against each other for his own amusement. Apparently, there have been incidents that resulted in injuries and even a girl who had to quit school. Come on. Damn, this guy's messed up. What a jerk. We absolutely have to change his heart. Yeah, but... I agree, but he thinks all women are meant to be conquered, right? Might be kind of dangerous for you, no? Ugh. No way. But I guess you can't be so sure in mementos. Let's be careful out there. All right. That's a spirit. I don't like anyone who treats other people like crap either. Let's hurry up and change his heart. Yep. No objections, right? We're good to go if you're okay with it. That's a unanimous decision. All that's left now is to take down the target in mementos. I guess we didn't say the mother's aggression one because we kind of discussed it before? Sort of? Well, let's go then. At the moment, our target count of mementos is three. Well, let's go. Oh, I didn't go get the money boost from Chahaya, but we've got like two million. I can't be fucked. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Do 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 do. Be, be, be. It's gonna really important. piss off so that fucking focus. womanizer dude if we take the team of three girls with us. Okay. So we've got at least one in here. Uh, let's go to the middle of it, I guess, and see what Morgana says. Sensing the target deeper inside. Okay. We need to go deeper. Not this floor. I'll target somewhere in the area. Analyzing the field. Do, 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 do. Oh, just straight ahead, lovely. Then huh? let's -a go. Who have we got? Shadow spotted. Is she that gamer Shinya's mom? She looks like she would bite us if we even tried to speak to her. I heard she's the definition of a helicopter parent. She goes, she's really selfish too. We gotta do something about this. Kids really look up to their parents, you know? Right. Let's go, guys. Sup, bitch? <laughs> you can't survive in this cold, harsh world if you're too soft. No one will help a single mother. Everyone just looks at me coldly. Everyone is my enemy. I have to fight them. I have to smash them before they can smash me. 
Stop playing the victim. You're making your son suffer. What do you know? You don't know me. We have to be strong. We don't have a safety net to catch us if we fall. I'm just fighting for my own happiness. I don't want others to mock us anymore. Do 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 do. Anyone who tries to get in my way should die. I don't know about that one, Chief. Do 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 She might actually take... I'm going to concentrate. Because it seems like she's got a fair whack of health. Persona. I think it's going to take another round to get to her. Do, 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 do. Ooh, Joker. You're looking cool. Do it. That's not going to be so great for you. Yeah, On will definitely finish her off. Ninety-nine. I can't believe I lost. I can. Do you know who I just beat? I just beat the fucking Prime Minister. Who the fuck are you? I lost. I'm going to get everything taken from me again. Society sees me as a loser. I've got no money. I've got no reason to be proud of myself. What the hell am I supposed to do? You have your son. Shinya. I have Shinya. Yes, I realize that now. The greatest happiness was with me this whole time. I have to be a good mother for his sake. This mother will have a change of heart now. I should head to Shinya. Unfortunately, there's not enough days, because this today is two days remaining, and he's only on rank eight. So even if he appeared tomorrow on one day remaining, I could only get him to rank nine, and then it would be story time, and then I don't think there's gonna be a point to get him to rank ten after that, so I think that's just fucked. Alright. Another case solved. What's next? Do we keep exploring? We do. There are no more targets in this area. What's our next move, Joker? Keep going. I just thought. Don't they normally show us the new area when you arrive at Mementos? So I guess a new area hasn't appeared yet. Because it's not normally, you don't normally have to go down to the bottom and then get shown it, right? It normally just appears. I think. Do, do, do. Bow, bow. Do, Whoa, this do, area is pitch black. Ooh, spooky! <laughs> God damn it. This is actually kind of annoying. of them later? Please? Oh, thank God. Right, from here, we can just move down to here. Uh, where were, where are they likely to be? Let's go to the rest area six. Deeper inside, okay.
That one wasn't green. Oh, we've got a will seed to give Jose, don't we? Hey, mister. Crystal of pride. It is a crystal. Take it. Good. All done. Now it should do you some good. Here you go. Let me know if you find any others like it, okay? Learning about warp cognitions also teaches me more about humans. The Ring of Pride. Any items we want to trade? Do 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 We have 45 stamps. We could just pump up that uh that XP, but we will not. We will not. Alrighty, what is this new item, eh? The Ring of Pride. Tyrant's Will. Is this what he used against us? Bears the seal of an egotist. Increases wearer's defense for three turns at start of battle. Is that it? The next physical attack deals over double the damage for one ally. Man, that's kind of boring. Just It's just a... Fucking defense boost at the start of battle. That is really boring compared to the previous one. That your first magic attack automatically is charged. Like, that's sick. Oh well. That internet sure is full of information. You need to have a trained eye to judge what's worth your time. Do, 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 do. Hmm? Then. There's a shadow waiting around here. Focus. Wait, what? Oh. I've gone too far, haven't I? gonna be down here. It's a step forward. <laughs> Level 69. Let's go. 